Hello everyone, it's Anna from Anna's Paper Creations and I have another guest design team project to share with you and it's uh, for Pion Design and that is a Swedish uh, company and I will put the link here below to the website where you can find the store finder and also a lot of inspiration and I will also post the link to Pinterest below the video so there you can also find a lot of uh, pictures of the papers and uh, uh, projects made with them. So here I made a napkin holder and uh, for this uh, project I used uh, the papers uh, for Mother uh, from Pion Design and uh, the idea for this came from this one napkin holder that I bought in my shop so I just uh, took the measurements here and uh, created uh, this box uh, out of uh, shipboard so uh, in the front here I fussy cut uh, some ladies and uh, I took Claudine Helmut Multimat on to stiffen them a bit and also outlined them with a SIG pen and uh, also made a, a table in the middle here with some coffee cups or teacups and a tea can here and uh, this uh, lamp post here is a die from uh, Sherry Lynn looks like so and they come in a set of uh, two and I backed it with uh, some uh, pink paper and uh, this uh, gazebo is a uh, die from um, Spellbinders and it's uh, this one and uh, I put it together with um, uh, this uh, uh, gilded gate and that's what you see on the sides here and uh, then I also used this uh, uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce it uh, iron. So uh, I like to put the different dies together and uh, create their own shape. That's really fun to do. So uh, and uh, all this paper also I have uh, distressed with uh, white paint dabber. And down here I cut um, from the border strip from the paper line and also fuss I cut out some small flowers. I'm not sure you can see it here. And uh, here are some um, butterflies from uh, Marta Stjurpunch. And uh, the lace that goes around all the box here is two different laces. They are from Creative Scrappy. So I will post the link to them below. And uh, yeah, then I think I showed it all here. You know, some pearl string that I had from my stash that I glued on around here. And um, these uh, feet here I uh, distressed uh, with some mixed paint to get the color I wanted and then I wiped it off with a, with a cloth. And these are from Tim Holtz. So for the side here I have some forks and uh, no, I don't remember the name of uh, Norwegian, we call it the stick. And it's uh, this die here and it's a magnolia die. And here is a bow punch from Marta Stewart. And I took a pearl pen in the middle here. So here I also used around all the here uh, the strip from uh, the paper line. It's really beautiful. So it looks like a lace so almost. So uh, on this side here I use some seam binding. And this is a rose from Wild Orchid Crafts. And uh, here are some uh, butterflies with uh, some uh, stamens uh, behind here. This punch is also from uh, Marta Stewart. It's the same punch as uh, the small ones. They come in the same punch. And here I have some uh, pearl uh, spray and also some uh, beads here on the silver wire and uh, seam binding and uh, yeah, and the lace and the pearl goes around. And for this side here I had <laughs> this leftover from another project I made so I decided to use it here. So um, this is also a die from Sherry Lynn. Looks like so. So I hope I was all in frame here. <laughs> Tried to zoom in a bit. So inside I also layered it with uh, uh, the pink paper and distressed a bit around with a um, white uh, paint on the sides here. So uh, this uh, was my project and uh, yeah, I can show you. I have uh, the templates if you like to know them. 
so it's uh, six and uh, one quarter high and six and three uh, quarter wide so I will post uh, this on my blog if you like to know the measurements so and also post the link below the video so thank you so much for watching everyone and I wish you all a happy and a great day take care bye bye